today we'll talk about scissor sweep three options it's good for sambo jiu-jitsu grappling and judo let's go i welcome you to sila partner channel ivan vasilchuk ruslan fartakov and this move i showed four and a half years ago so now we'll with better quality turnover or sweep scissors when we snip like this oh the principle is the same you need to cut with your legs but some guys have a problem they try to do it with their legs but forget about arms arms are hanging the main idea here in scissors it's not so much over leg work but negating his support arm so let's look at legs first grappler jiu-jitsu sambo everybody works different somebody full guard somebody half guard somebody that's butterfly guard it doesn't matter in this move our goal um uh, one leg is on the outside one leg is on the inside that's a must one leg will negate that way and the other one will elevate elevate body L like this this is the motion so options you can put your foot here prop against the knee or just simply lay across the shin the calf with your hands you're doing like a steering action like you're driving a car like this switch this way twist but make sure to add your body not just arms without body uh addition you lose your force so our goal twist like this pull the arm this is support arm if he pulls the arm it's going to be hard to sweep him he'll be elevating his butt and all that so we need to pull this arm three options start with the first one first i would have grabbed like this by the wrist end of the sleeve lapel here by the armpit maybe behind the back it doesn't matter lapel is fine we'll pull him towards us one leg on top one on the bottom and watch i bring his wrist towards me and twist him then on top and you can do armbar or mount staying pin if his butt is close to his heels it's going to be hard to sweep him yeah i gotta pull to elevate his posture you see even if he grabs my lapel it's of no consequence we can still sweep him most important not allow him to prop his arm if he props his arm he'll be balanced control the arm and twist I'll tell you it's a harder option because to hold wrist it, it's hard sometimes I like duck under dive under rather if he wants to pin you like this chest to chest he closed me locked me in if I have my legs on the inside it will work if the outside it's gonna be hard so at least one should be on the inside so he's here look I got two arms I link my arms where his chest is the other side of the chest slightly below shoulder blades collect the grip and looking below shoulder blades straighten out our legs be tight stay tight and you can twist like this or get the leg on top sweep to pin so we're wrestling and I got my double unders extended I love that option the most myself do not invent new grips grapplers ask what about jacket or gear no there's no need just double underhooks sometimes they can show that you lost the grip and he jump on top just lay down but extend your legs break his back so to speak proverbially you see band it is it hard to breathe hard to breathe and he's yours completely and the third option get both arms double over hooks like this in grappling just like this in sambo jiu-jitsu you can get lapel too you see like this and cross over for the second one or just two arms this way by the gi grabbed him 
pulled him towards, propped the leg, and swept. And armbar. The important part here, to elevate his hips. If his hips are not lifted, it's going to be hard to sweep. So you want to lift him up, pull him, butt elevates. Center of gravity is on top of me. And now it's easy to sweep with legs. And arms, of course, too. What about defense? If somebody tries to sweep you, you want to drop your hips down, maximally down, or if they pulled you, lay down on my legs like this, so I could not catch the far leg and my body's lying down. Spread your legs further, yeah. Just stretched out and it's gonna be hard to swim. You can do some arm lock, but if he's lying down like this and, and holding your hips, you can still do scissors. The variety of scissors is tremendous. Get the belt, control this arm like this, get the other arm and roll him. Physically a little bit harder, should have strong legs, but you can rock him and get stronger. Scissors could be done when leg is on the inside, when it's outside, but it's more like strigunok. We go on our side and, and sweep like this. Some scissors are slightly more coated, one leg here, one leg here, but over here, on a sweep you go on your side, in sambo, and in freestyle, guys are always driving, so you can catch somebody. If people from grappling or jiu-jitsu, they kind of pull back a little bit, of course. Uh, in sambo and freestyle, you have very little time, so you gotta do fast, otherwise you'll get stood up. So that's why it's working in jiu-jitsu better. So just pull them up, right? Don't go too deep into detail, slightly different mechanics because we're working with knee. So we'll look at this one next time. Today we'll look at scissors, the elementary ones. Uh, kids training I have. And the first one that I teach, first turnover, first sweep, is scissor, very simple. Uh, just grab, uh, rolled over on top. And they do it with pleasure. It's easy, understandable. And of course it helps them in wrestling. Use it. And like my stuff. Subscribe to the channel. Don't even describe it, discuss it. But if you're not subscribed, please do subscribe. Потому что нужно иметь сильные ноги. Но она работает. Можно качнуть влево, вправо, потом хоп и сверху. Затягиваем и начинаем свиповать.